On a Stuart Stevens, you got two dead man switches. They both gotta be on to make it active to where we can start the truck. When you climb up in, be sure and grab your handles and pull yourself up in so you don't fall. Now that we're in the truck, a Stuart Stevens, the green button, push down, push your red button to start. Your air brake switch is like on any semi, the yellow button you push down. You got a hand throttle, you got your foot throttle, you got your brake pedal. The headlights are automatically wired to where when you turn ignition on, they burn. There's no switches. The blower motor is right here on the console, on the dash. First button. It says heat, says defrost, leave vent in, or you'll get cold air. It's an automatic truck. The controller is on the left side. Drive or reverse is all you need on it. And we got a two-way radio in the Stuart Stevens. And that ought to be everything you need inside the cab. This is your pre-wet tank for the calcium chloride when they want you to use pre-wet. You fill it right here on the fender of the truck. Got a valve you hook on with and fill it. The state will help you fill it. We not, cannot fill it without their assistance. On a Stuart Stevens, this is an auger bed. There's an auger in here that pulls the salt out. You can look in here and make sure that your salt is coming out. Under here is your spinner motor. Make sure your spinner is working and ain't stopped up. Then you'll walk on around the truck. On the Stuart Stevens, this is your Muncie hydraulic tank. When you come around here, it's got a sight glass. As long as it's half full of oil, we're good. On the Stuart Stevens, on the right side is your fuel tank, fuel cap, open it up, fill it up, put the cap back on. This is your snow plow on the Stuart Stevens. When you walk around them, just check to make sure you don't have no hydraulic leaks on the front. This is your cutting edge we've talked about. The two fingers is right here. They end up being about six to eight fingers when you start. If they get past two fingers, they gotta be changed. Check both sides because it will wear unevenly according to which side of the road you're plowing out. That is the introduction to a Stuart Stevens plow truck. If you have any following questions, direct them to Andrea at the office and she will get them to the right person to answer your questions. We thank you very much for your help and time.